Oui, on est là juste pour protester contre ce qui se passe au Congo. Et nous savons tous que le peuple congolais a choisi euh, Yachichi. Mais comme euh, les Européens veulent toujours continuer à maintenir le Congo dans la dictature, donc nous, allons, nous sommes ici juste pour protester contre tout ce qu'ils font. Mais ils doivent savoir que non, il euh, y a toutes choses à son temps. Donc euh, maintenant, c'est le temps du Congolais. Et ils doivent apprendre à changer et à comprendre que le temps et la, les périodes changent. Mais les Blancs n'aiment pas changer. Mais ils changeront toujours. Car ce n'est pas nous qui avons choisi d'être nés au Congo. C'est Dieu qui a voulu. Donc ce n'est pas notre problème, c'est le problème de Dieu. C'est lui qui va résoudre cela. Que Dieu vous bénisse, que Dieu bénisse le Congo. Je vous remercie. Passi, mite mes akuna, kuna ma belle, ma mitole za rende kuna. To tene pour la sake, to za bo moko na bino. To lingiete, ate to lingiete. To zo luka ba tuna enyo so, ba ne ko to luka bango. Se ko za na ba dress bo tinda. To za na moko 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 moko. To so susu mi susu. To tia ngola internet. To zo luka luka, se bo suka fruit, ba Facebook ya li, bo tinda ba dress. Donc on l'exemple en tout. Pas si. Nous sommes là. Jusqu'à être Obama Masco. Et Kabila 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 Obama Masco. If Kabila says Obama must go. If Kabila says Obama must go. If Kabila says Obama must go. If... Bon, on est ici devant CNN pour notre pays, hein, le Congo. On continue à se battre. Kabila doit partir et on se bat pour nos frères et sœurs. On n'a pas pu être là pour offrir notre support. Présentement, nous sommes ici aux États-Unis, leurs supportants et savons que la situation est difficile. Nous voulons que tout le peuple congolais, le pays, nous voulons que tout le monde puisse savoir que nous sommes tous ensemble. Au pays ou en dehors du pays, nous sommes toujours congolais. Peu importe le passeport que j'ai dans, dans ma poche, je suis toujours et je le serai toujours, je suis toujours congolais. Alors nous je sommes suis toujours fier ensemble. Hein? Et nous sommes fiers d'être congolais. Peu importe ce qu'on vous dit, nous sommes ensemble et cette lutte sera longue et populaire. 
qu'on abîme au bout. So it's probably one of the richest countries in the world when we're talking about resources. And we do have some of the richest politicians in the world. Yet, the Congolese people is among the poorest population in the world. That's why we're here today, because we're trying to give voice to our sisters and brothers who voted back home for President Tisekedi. Instead, the community, the um, international co community and everybody else want to force us to abide and to bend down to the regime of Kabila. We don't want Kabila in the Congo, we want Tisekedi. Peace. On our country, Congo, you know, People are being dying, you know. Um, we don't want the president, so we here to support the country. Here today, in front of the CNN building, we're trying to get the attention of our people here in the United States of America. We are Congolese. We are from the Democratic Republic of the Congo, and we are so very disappointed. What happened? We have been waiting for the results of the presidential elections for a long time. They were supposed to proclaim the elections, the results on the 6th of December. Unfortunately, they gave us another 48 hours to wait. We waited for another 48 hours, and they told us that Kabila has won the elections. Well, we do not agree with that results because we here are the people, and the people should be able to be free to choose their own president. Well, the United States of America, along with France and other international countries, we are very um, disappointed with the international committee because they are preaching democracy, but they don't, they don't want us Congolese to have that freedom, to have that democracy in our country. So we have nothing personal against Kabila, who is the actual president, but our problem is he has been there for 10 years. 10 years is enough for somebody to rule. We don't see any change. We don't see anything that we have benefited from. The country is still the poorest country of all countries in the world, so it's time for a change. So our change is we need a new president, whether it be Chisekedi, whether it be anybody else, anybody other than Kabila, because we are shedding whatever. We are trying. We are trying. We are trying. We are trying. Ben ouais, comme notre frère vient de dire, euh, on est tous là pour protester contre les résultats. C'était déjà crédi et euh, on est là à Atlanta avec un groupe d'amis congolais, tous unis pour euh, faire face à cette euh, proclamation des résultats. Normalement, c'est tellement frauduleux que bon, on ne peut même pas l'accepter. On est là, on est là, on va se battre jusqu'au bout. Merci. Standing here in front of CNN, we are protesting the electoral result that was given out concerning Kabila winning presidency. First of all, the people have spoken. Why we still have to deal with corruption after all these years? First of all, when President Barack Obama held a meeting back in 2008, He's in Ghana, Accra. President Barack Obama stated that the population should take over the situation of Africa, rebuild their countries. And we, the people, the African people, we have taken a stand. We want to rebuild our country, we want to do something positive, but we cannot do that. What happened to our democracy? Well, we still have the international committee appointing Kabila as a president. It's a different hidden form of dictatorship. We cannot have a leader who has such a 
such a bad impact on the country. Right now, the Congo is number one, number one in the world. The highest rate of women rape. It's inconceivable, okay? We have children that are dying every day. People are being killed. Eight million people died. And now we are standing and the population have spoken. We need a change. Kabila must go. We need a change. Kabila must go. We need a change. Kabila must go.